Hey guys, so today I'm here and I'm going to be trying some UK snacks and I'm super excited about it because they have some stuff that we don't have in the States at all and it looks kind of weird, it looks kind of good, so I'm excited to try it. So let's get into it. Guess who's back in the hell? I got a big bag of stuff. I got another bag right here. And we finna get eating. Okay, so I'm gonna start with the like chips first, or as they like to call them, crisp. And let's get into that. So, the first thing is already open, so yes, I tried it already, but I just want to still show it. So I want to start with this brand first. It's called Walkers, and that's like the Lay's of the UK. So they have a bunch of different chips, and then I didn't buy a bunch of their chip flavors, but I got these, and they're called Quavers, and it says light, curly, potato snack, cheese flavor. And, okay, so I got this from a man who works in my... Um, where I'm living at and he told me these were the best chips ever Can we believe him? I don't know. So he said so when I took it out the bag the, My first observation was you know in America when you see the flavor cheese You're gonna get a very orange chip and he was like no that's like a Cheeto. So this is what we're working with Okay, this is a quaver So it's not nasty, it's really good. I don't really know how to describe the flavor of it. The flavor. But it's not cheesy. Mm -mm. It's giving me more of a onion, funion vibe, but not as strong as a funion. If that makes sense. It's not really giving me cheese, but it's good. I will give it that. So, let's dig in our bag. Next thing we're trying, Doritos. Okay, so we all know that we love Doritos back home. Nacho cheese. They don't have that. They have tangy cheese. So, I'm just going to open these up. They smell just like nacho cheese. So, let's see. okay it's not as cheesy as our chips and it has more of a corn chip flavor and I know it is a corn chip but usually with Doritos back home I get more of a cheese than corn chip flavor so there's that it wasn't bad though I I would I I could finish them but it's not the best chip ever so we're gonna move on okay so I got more Doritos, okay. And I'm trying the Chili Heat Wave Doritos because we all love a good hot chip and they don't really sell a lot of hot chips out here, I've noticed. So I wanted to go ahead and try this one. So let's get into this. Oh my God. <laughs> okay. So when I look into the bag, let me show y'all. Okay, so when I look into the bag, this is what I see. I don't really see like any signifiers of this is gonna be a hot chip, but let's go ahead and try. So. This 
This is it. Look. This is really good. I'm sorry. I'm about to go dumb on you. This is really good. Hold on. I'm going to eat the whole bag. Sis. This is really good. That one is really good. It gives me like, so you know America, the purple bag? Doritos. Chili heat wave. It tastes like the purple bag. I'm gonna smack the whole bag of them chili heat waves cause that was good. Okay. Okay. Last crisp I'm trying. Pringles, Texas barbecue. And we got barbecue Pringles at home too. But, you know, there's a Texas. Go ahead. Okay, so the first thing that I note is our barbecue, our idea of barbecue flavor is different than their idea of barbecue flavor. I don't really know how to describe it. But, mm-mm. It's not the same, but these are good. And now we're moving into our sweet snacks. I'm trying is Kit Kats, but not just plain Kit Kats, cookies and cream flavor. Eating is right here. And this doesn't come in like the package that we're used to. It's like this foil. And ooh, this is what it looks like. Back side is like this. So I'm just gonna break it. Take a bite. Mmm. <laughs> this is good. Super chocolatey. But it's really good. The next sweet snack I got was. Okay. So I think it's blue rib band. Blue rib band. I don't know. They be pronouncing stuff different than us, so I don't know. I'm scared, but it's these, and it's caramel flavor. And it kind of reminded me of like a Twix, but I decided I'd go ahead and try it. So it comes with eight in a pack. Oh, this actually says new, so just that new new. Okay, so this is what it looks like. Got the pack, just a little mini one. And let's open it up. Ooh. Interesting. This is what it looks like. Okay. Um, should I break it? Should I bite it? I'm gonna bite it. Disgusting. That was hard to bite. But it wasn't nasty. But that was hard to bite. Chocolate is like a super, super thin layer, so it doesn't really give too much chocolate, which could be good, could be bad, depending on who you ask. This is good, but that biscuit, the little cookie, mm -mm, too hard. I got one more snack. The snack I got were popsicles. And they're smoothie popsicles, which sounds so good to me because I like smoothie, I like popsicle. So they have two flavors. They have raspberry and they have mango. So I tried the mango ones yesterday because I couldn't resist. That's why I went shopping. So today I'm going to be trying the raspberry ones. And this is what it looks like. I'll show you that out the pack. But yeah, let me smack in the freezer. I wanted to compare this maybe to like a fruit bar back in the U.S. How we have like, um, you know, that's like the closest thing that I could think of that I personally have eaten that could be like this. But I never had like a smoothie type of bar. So this is what it looks like. Just a little pink bar. This is the raspberry flavor again. So, 
Yeah. Okay. This is weird to eat on camera. Oh, my teeth. It's very, like, it's really sweet. Where sometimes they might lack out here because, you know, like, they be a little healthy with everything. But this is really sweet. It's really good. I will say the mango one that I had yesterday tasted more, like, fresh. And this tastes more, like, like artificial raspberry flavoring, which they're probably both artificial, I'm sure. But, like, I'm just saying, like, the mango one had more of a fresh, like, they literally blended up the mango right here and gave it some type of ordeal, but ooh, that was nasty. But this is really good too, so. Okay, let me rate, let me rate. So Quavers, I give a six out of 10. Tangy cheese Doritos, I give four out of 10. Chili Heat Wave, I give a 10 out of 10. Texas Barbecue Pringles, I give maybe like a 7.5, 8 out of 10, somewhere around there. To rate the Kit Kats, I'm giving that a 9 out of 10. The Blue Ribbon Bar, whatever it is, I don't know what it is, I'm going to give that a 5 out of 10. It was good, but it was hard. And I want to be able to chew what I'm eating. And the popsicle, I'm going to give that a 9 out of 10. So, almost everything I had was really good. So far, I'm liking the snacks out here. I might do a part 2 where I try other snacks because they had so much to choose from. I didn't even know what to get. I didn't even know, like, what I was trying my luck with. But I might do a part 2. So, let me know if you guys want to see that. Comment below if you want to see a part 2 with different snacks. I'd be happy to do that. But until then, I will see you later. Hopefully you guys will be able to try these snacks one day too. I don't know. And thank you for watching. Bye.